U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry says U.S. officials will never give up in their search for those responsible for acts of terrorism. He said he was pleased with the results of two U.S. raids over the weekend on targets in Libya and Somalia. The United States of America will never stop in its effort to hold those accountable who conduct acts of terror. And those uh, members of Al-Qaeda and other terrorist organizations uh, literally can run the camp high. On Saturday, U.S. forces in Tripoli, Libya, captured a senior leader of Al-Qaeda, a man known as Abu Anas Alibi. They suspect he was involved in the 1998 bombings of U.S. embassies in Kenya and Tanzania. Spokespersons for the transitional government in Libya issued a statement following the raid. They expressed their dissatisfaction that they weren't informed beforehand. They say they're asking the U.S. for clarifications. Also on Saturday, U.S. forces in Somalia tried to capture leaders of the Islamic militant group Al-Shabaab. Members of the group claim responsibility for a hostage siege last month on a shopping mall in Nairobi, Kenya. U.S. government officials have not disclosed the details of the operation. U.S. media are reporting that the raid was carried out by Navy SEALs, but it's not clear whether they achieved their objective.